Andrew in the United Kingdom writes, I did some electronics at college, although I never followed it up much. Okay. My quest is that a transformer is a difficult, uh, or my question is that a transformer is a difficult component, sensitive to the frequencies in terms of its inductive reactance and output. And I've heard that what you hear is the transformer, not the valves, in terms of the sound characteristics. Can you comment on that? And why do they use a transformer in valve amps? And is the nature of the component more critical than the valve? Okay, kind of a, all right, let me see if I can uh, uh, dissect that for you. What he's asking is, well, a couple of things, and I'll explain why they use transformers, but in a valve amp, in a, in a vacuum tube power amplifier, the output unless it's what we call an OTL, which is an out for, uh, output transformerless um, amplifier, which those are rare. So most tube amplifiers have output transformers, and they have that because vacuum tubes in general don't like low impedances. They don't work well in the low impedances. So a transformer has an input side and an output side. And on the input side, the, the windings are fairly high impedance. So the vacuum tube puts out its voltage into this high impedance, and at the output, we get lower voltage coming out at lower impedance, which can drive a loudspeaker, okay? So that's all well and good. Transformers definitely have a sound to them, without question. And so that's the reason why you need a transformer, is because most tubes can't handle the low impedance of a speaker, and so this transformer transforms impedance from high to low and tubes are happy. And yes, it does make a sound. So, um, which one is more? A lot of that depends on the windings of the transformer and how it's actually built. Some manufacturers put, oh, hundreds and hundreds of dollars into premium transformers that sound amazing. And those transformers, I would say, have very little sound contribution relative to the vacuum tube circuitry. Other more affordable power amplifiers put less expensive output transformers in there. And the less expensive, the poorer the design of the output transformer, the more you're going to hear it. So it's a balancing act. And if you're going out and you're buying a thousand dollar vacuum tube power amplifier and it has an okay transformer, I would say probably you're here in 50 50. Uh, it can be that high. Transformers definitely have a sound to themselves, but the very best ones that people have really invested time, money, and engineering skill, they can sound pretty dang neutral. So, yeah, like everything. Know the brand, know the designer, and take that for what it's worth. All right? Thanks. Appreciate the question. Good luck.